there's the initiation, uh, there's the initiation of this uh, projector. Sometimes we see in Tanga, <coughs> uh, you know, uh, the lower part of the body is sort of like a snack, snack body, you see, but the whole body is full of eyes, you know, arms, and belly, you see, one protector called Sa. <coughs> so <coughs> there's Jenang, there's Jenang, you can receive that. And then uh, you have to open Toma for two to nine days in the, when, the sun, when the sun sets. When the sun sets, you see, when there's a. Uh, you know, this, this, um, so, mm, mm, uh, something like this distance before sunset, before sunset down to the mountain, you see, maybe before sunset down. So, mm, this, this length, you see, distance. Should mm, mm. <coughs> so it says it like an uh, arrow, it says. Uh, so maybe the error. So maybe this, maybe this, this size. <coughs> this, this, this much, this much space left on the sun to set down. See, so that time you offer Toma <coughs> to this uh, protector called Sa. <coughs> uh, so you, uh, so I think the parallel is, of course, in the West, in the West is not known. It, this, 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 this part of a phenomena is not known. Uh, this particular sickness, particular sickness is connected with the particular spirits, in particular nagas, you know, uh, different beings are connected. So that, that's another condition. That's not the main cause, but that's another condition, you see. So first of all, there's karma of the person, karma of the person, uh, the past, past action, you see, the cause that, uh, that would cause the person to get these sicknesses, okay? And there's, uh, then there's spirit harm condition. Of course, they can be in the external condition too. Can be, can be like that. But uh, mm, <coughs> so these, uh, is what's possible? Maybe the external condition, food, whatever, something. Maybe um, you know, uh, able to recognize the possible. But uh, the karma is not known. The ca- the came from the mind of the person. Karma is not known, and the spirit harm is not known. So the, there's many explanations for the you know the problems of the life. Uh, why, in the problems of the person, problem happening in the person's life, uh, sicknesses. And so, <coughs> especially in this case, paralysis, this, there's a sa, is connected. So then this sa, mm, so the, <coughs> you offer trauma for 29 days. Just one, just very short trauma, you know, but specific that time, people sunset sat down, you know, there's this much distance, you see, uh, size, uh, length of arrow, uh, uh, arrow, you see. So, <coughs> so that, so, <coughs> so uh, in that specific time that you have trauma, that's it, just not, not much, just that. So if you do that for 29 days, uh, from starting from the first up to the next, 29, from the first to up to 29th, then, uh, then that means for, I don't know, for <coughs> many, uh, say, Mm, I don't remember a little bit of forgetting, but many, I, mean, I think millions of, I think millions of lifetimes, you never get paralysis. Uh, you never get paralysis. Uh, so that, if you do that trauma offering to that, uh, so, so that, mm, so, <clears throat> yeah, <coughs> so there's this, um, <coughs> and there's also meditation, yeah, there's, a med- there's this prayer, uh, oral transmission I received from, which is the Outer Mongolian, the, uh, ab, who, who was abbot in, in Tibet, Saraman, Che, after the 20 years of the heavy destruction. Uh, so, <coughs> received, and there was uh, I think it was also recent time from uh, abbot of, who was abbot of Saraman, Thakpur Rinpoche, the Great Lama. So, <coughs> oh, they received the jalang of this, but I haven't done yet. The, from offering where you need one place during traveling you cannot do you have at one place you see that exact time of something then you have to offer Thomas so, uh, uh, <coughs> um, <coughs> but then the the Rinpoche received this 
from uh, the Guru of His Son Dalam and also His Son Sagatinzi, from well, for His Son Sagatinzi received many initi- you know, so many initiations from the Jujitian uh, So then, then Rambuchi asked to Thapu Rambuchi that to take. To get all transmission in order to give the genome to other people <laughs> of this uh, and then Rinpoche needs to get all transmission of the Kudekundi. Uh, then uh, Rinpoche had one nun, <coughs> Rinpoche had one, I think maybe ne- the nephew or cousin. Cousin is male or female? Cousin is male. No, it could be either. Female. And, uh, there was one nun called Jizuma. <coughs> Jizuma. <coughs> Rumbach uh, calls Jizuma. Jizuma is a, uh, I mean, I say, in, 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 the, in the simple translation, perfect. <coughs> like Jizun Dojin Nanjoma. Jizun Dojin Nanjoma. Jizun Sip. Dojin Nanjoma is a Vajra Guinea. So, <coughs> so Rumbach calls her, this nun, uh, very good nun, uh, you know, edu- educated, educated, you know. Mm, yeah, I mean, it's a, yeah, <clears throat> one nun was educated. So, she must be something very special because Rinpoche seems to respect to her. So, the Rinpoche is selected. Yeah, but you're going to treat all that thing. So, so then Rinpoche asked Tapa Rinpoche. To check all transmission, to, to be able to give the initiation to others, the sa, you know, then you need to have the lung of the judukundu, this, you know, um, this, um, the all transmission of all this, you know, I think the initiation that takes to happen, you know, I think, well, um, little less, well, hundred, I mean, hundreds of days, probably hundreds of days, you know. <laughs> So he was asked to take Rinpoche, Buzi Rinpoche, his very old age aspect. So then asked Thapa Rinpoche to take um, from the nun, from Rinpoche's relative nun, and then half from the nun, half from the one Inkan Lama, uh, one Ivan Yang Inkan Lama, who was, uh, who was Rinpoche's, attend- Rinpoche's attendant. So Thapa Rinpoche, uh, so, um, you know, was, uh, the <laughs> great Lama, the uh, Saramba, and the, you know, from Tibet, and the oh, great Lama, you see, the, um, the not ordinary being, <coughs> who was, uh, I mean, uh, regard one protector. Anyway, so, uh, <coughs> so, um, uh, so I remember it was, I think, the truth, the truth. Two months or three months or to the loom from the one, the nun, the one, the Rinpoche, young Rinpoche, who is the attendant of Chujo Rinpoche. So, <laughs> so that, that happened. But normally it doesn't need that loom, but Chujo uh, Rinpoche asked Rinpoche to take the loom of that. So, that too, I think, I don't know, two months or something like that, three months or two months or something like that. Anyway, yeah, <coughs> I'm just, <coughs> no, just, um, it's just news, you know. To not news, to not uh, to not a TV channel. <laughs> so anyway, <coughs> there's a Buddhist mantra you can recite to not get paralysis, you know, strokes, these things. So the in the West is not developed, uh, you know, the um, the all the um, the, the, um, the co- I mean the evolutions, you know, I mean the cause conditions all that. I, mean, just, um, I say. There's many more not 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 discovered yet. So <coughs> so this um, and that <coughs> so <coughs> once you go to stroke, <coughs> even small, <coughs> but there's a mantra um tumbuli tumbuli susun me meshiksha soha. So you have to recite that seven times. Mm. There's two mantra of that. Um tumbuli tumbuli susun me meshiksha soha. Tumbuli tumbuli bhikti meshiksha soha. So uh, every side, the, the, 
not not others are starting for that person. No, person himself, herself has to recite this seven times. Uh, so <clears throat> if you <clears throat> if you do that, if you do that, then you ne- you never get the second paralysis, second stroke. You never get. Rimji, could you say the mantra slowly, please, so we could. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I chant. Slowly. Maybe I chant. Slowly. Huh? Slowly. Probably just sleep for one hour. Om tumboli tumboli. Om tumboli tumboli. Susu me me shik shik sovaha. Susu me me shik shik suaha. That, that, uh, <clears throat> so you can say that seven times, you see. The another one, om tumboli tumboli big tum mi shik suaha. Om tumboli tumboli susu, the first one, tumboli, om tumboli tumboli susu me me shik shik suaha. That's the first one, okay? Second one, Om tumbali tumbali victum victum mishik soha. Om tumbali tumbali victum mishik soha. So what happened was that this one I mean I saw the mantra, but particular that I came to come to find out this it was a. <clears throat> Even though I have seen the mantras, I mean, here and there, <coughs> one Lama, um, which uh, name is actually to mention, uh, Lama Shishi. <coughs> so when um, in the United, when Lama came to California, and then um, so, <coughs> to the, uh, took uh, the par- par- paralysis uh, that aspect. <coughs> so, <coughs> so that time, Rinpoche, his own son, Rinpoche. Um, so, uh, Rinpoche was in Switzerland giving teachings in Geshe Rabdi Rinpoche's monastery uh, there. Uh, so, who's a, who's a Lama Ishi, my own teacher. <coughs> great, uh, I mentioned, I think, some time ago, that story. Great, uh, great scholar, uh, you know, a high agent, being a great professional. So, <coughs> he's on song, so I rang Rinpoche and then they invited Rinpoche to do, uh, to do puja mm, through a high gawa. Not a mostly high gawa, but a sikri high gawa. Uh, there's, a, there's a special puja that you will relieve, that you will relieve that person from their sicknesses. Uh, uh, mm, mm. So, <coughs> it's a, that puja is quite common, the high gawa, a sikri high gawa puja. Uh, uh, so, the, <coughs> uh, so then, but after I had done that, I went back to Switzerland, then Lama, uh, yeah, then I said, yeah, so, so uh, yeah, Lama, uh, Lama passed away, then I can I better put back from Switzerland to California to the uh, puja, uh, uh, to put the puja there, see. Mm, so we did the Hiruga um, self-initiation and Bajorakana self-initiation, while the Lama's holy body is there, in the <coughs> so yeah, mm, I think Geshe Jelson, Geshe Jelson, the one who pa- recently passed away, she was there, and then, uh, <coughs> so <coughs> who who was um, who was um, working in London? Uh, he was a teacher of the Tibetan school there, and was working in the in the hospital. <coughs> <coughs> Just start talking. <coughs> so when we went to London, very first time, very first time, uh, that that the the course was arranged um, in one huge, uh, large building, I think, a school. <coughs> and so I uh, saw so Lama. And we heard this geshe was this geshe was going to come. So we're waiting. Um, we're waiting. <coughs> so later in the evening time, he came. I think he just came from hospital, you know, 
I was working in the hospital cleaning, at the public cleaning. And they, so the blue, kind of blue, blue, um, how do you call it? It's not a sweater, but a... Overalls. Huh? Overalls? Blue, blue, some, yeah, I don't know, yeah. Then the jeans, probably jeans, and then, you know what, long hairs like this. And then, he, he was, he, I mean, he was out of my kitchen before. <coughs> so, So he came then, yeah, talked then. <laughs> then that night, another night, then another day he made momos, he big piles of momos, he brought to us. To us. <laughs> uh, so uh, then his wife came also. Oh, uh, I don't know, I think maybe American later or something too. <coughs> so then Lama asked, Lama asked him, Lama asked, Lama suggested him leave the, leave the wife and the, that he, be, that he should be alone. That he should be alone. Because the, and the <coughs> while Lama asked, because the, she seemed very, um, I think, controlled Gishla, and she seemed very, uh, you know, very, um, very, very self-centered, you know, kind of a control, controlling. So, um, you know, very, very strong. So Lama told him, leave, leave her, and then, you know, that he should be alone. So then, <coughs> then they <laughs> uh, then Gisela Lama helped Gisela to from London to uh, come to California. <coughs> so they, uh, Dick um, Dick and Meredith, who lived in Kapan for many years, uh, many many years, it was old times. So they um, arranged calls in California when we came to first first time California. <coughs> so, <coughs> so they arranged. Uh, the, so Gisela came from London uh, to the United States. And so they arranged Gisela to teach in the university. So this Lama helped like that. Lama <coughs> said. So, yeah, so then Lama gave a dress for him. Lama's Lama's the morning morning dress. The you know the like what the what the what the, what the what the, what, the, what the Muslims wear, you know, the long dress. Uh, huh? With the sleeves and long dress. But it's red color, not, not white. Red, red color. <clears throat> so Lama's, uh, Lama's well, normal home dress or the morning dress. <coughs> so, because <coughs> he doesn't, doesn't, doesn't have, I mean, you know, cannot wear robes and that. <coughs> so Lama kept this for his, when he, when he teaches Dharma to wear this. So the long dress. So I guess yeah. So I guess it tells him you should come to Bajapani, uh, Lama. But so to keep teachings there from 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 LA, from Los Angeles. So I guess he used to wear this long dress and then keep the course at Bajapani. <laughs> so uh, I remember seeing, I think at least two times. I think. <laughs> So that was so. <laughs> so then I think he should have left the wife, you know, the that strong lady, strong lady. Uh, so. But I think it's, uh, this, uh, <coughs> uh, there was a child with her. So a child would maybe stay with the Gisela, I think. So then, <coughs> then, then there was another, I think Chinese or Mr. Sure was, but, but one other Chinese, one Chinese student, but she became a nun, of course. I think now she lives um, in, not, not less, but uh, Seattle or Colorado, I think. <coughs> anyway, just, just some old stories. Mm. <laughs> so, yeah, when Lama passed to the, uh, yeah, I guess she was there. I was there. It's not so long, but she, 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 then the first teacher at Vajapani, mm, with that which we invited, you know, the first resident teacher of Bajapani for five years or some, yeah, he passed away. Uh, not at the center, but, um, you know, then he, then he lived by himself, so. His name is Yatung, we call Yatung, but anyway, his name is Jalsun or something. Uh, we were no, he, no, normal name in the Marsh called Yikin Yatung, something like <coughs> So I uh, say, <coughs> yeah, so, um, 
So did this few days puja. Then the Rinpoche did the Jangwa to Lama's own body. So what happened was, since I'm talking this, since since I'm talking this, what there was there was Lama said there was plan to meditate after he passed. <coughs> when he passed away, to to be in the meditation state for one year, to you know, to be in the meditation state, whether whether by laying down or up, to be in the meditation state, to be in the meditation state for one year. <coughs> so, <coughs> uh, he did, Lama didn't tell me about that, but he was discussing with the uh, discussing with the Spanish nun who met this uh, you know Lao Tzu Lama this uh, the book. Um, and um, uh, maybe Pero and Claudio, I think, uh, the, those original Italians who came to Kapan in the, uh, the, uh, the, during the second meditation course, some, around that time, you see. <coughs> I think <coughs> maybe they were also there, but I mean, uh, Champa Chuji, the Spanish nun who, who were involved this, writing this book. So, <coughs> so I, I heard, but I, Lama was not telling me that he, that he, if, 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 if everybody came, all the students came one place to the Bajasapa retreat, then he would live for one year in in, in meditation state. In meditation, he would live. So <coughs> when I when I returned back to Nepal, and the, on the Lama's bed there was a book, notebooks. Because before he passed away, he went into the he went, well, we were Tushita, <coughs> Lama w- went through the books, through the m- many great Lamas, like Sun Shining in Tibet, you see, many great Lamas, like Papanka, many great Lamas happened, uh, uh, you know, like Sun Shining in the world, like that, you see, the propagated with Dharma and, uh, you know, unbelievable benefit of sentient beings. <coughs> you know, um, so many sentient beings, you see, so, I mean, living Dharma, you know, the achieve realization and, uh, you know, I mean, say, mm, so that, so that tantra to realization is achieved. So, man. so the, <coughs> so the some of the teachings, you know, some of the collections of works, Lama went through, uh, how they passed away, to check how they passed away. The stories, he especially went through check, and it was Lama's how they passed. Away. So I think Lama himself was p- making preparation to see. So <coughs> then, in the what passing way, the passing way it happened in the United States, <laughs> not not in Nepal or India. <coughs> so then, was I invited to the song and then. <coughs> so that was the Lama's from his side idea was that plan was that uh, one year to be in meditation state. You see. So, <coughs> so what I was saying was, so when I opened note at Nepal so on the Lama's table, then, then there was Shanti Deva was Shanti Deva was for many years in meditation state. Uh, a Lama wrote, you see. So I think yeah, he went through and uh, so Shanti Deva was one. Then maybe the others who were many years. Shanti Deva was one the many years in med- uh, meditation when passed away. See. <coughs> so that, so anyway, <coughs> the one place all the students to come, I mean, one place to do retreat. I mean, that time was, uh, of course, not easy. And so didn't, uh, that um, gathering that didn't happen. But uh, many, uh, Kapan, they did one year, day and night. People doing by the stuff for one year. So that happened. Different places, different places, many places. Or selling, and also I think, also maybe on New Zealand, I think many places, many centers, quite few centers did that. Uh, I say, <clears throat> so a on in a day and night, you see, the people see change that. So it did happen. Maybe also to see that, I think. So anyway, <coughs> so <coughs> that time, secretary was, uh, secretary was um, Jackie Menari. 
don't know you. And her, um, the, uh, her wish has been for many years, uh, you know, while she was studying school, she wanted to be a nurse and help people, help sick people. That was her main motivation. But Lama said, don't be a nurse. Because Lama had a very hard time in the hospital just before. So he said, don't be a nurse. And, uh, and, you know, uh, go, go to university, I mean to say. But, yeah, uh, yeah something. Um, maybe secretary, or I'm not sure. But don't be a nurse. Uh, <coughs> but this has been a hard wish, hard wish for many years. So I think she, um, yeah, I think she did nurse. <laughs> she, in the United States, she did nurse. She did nurse and she, she completed her and uh, yeah, no, no, she, she's a child and uh, that. <coughs> Maybe the sh uh, Shira person. You know. So anyway, <coughs> what's that? <coughs> so Lama's holy body, uh, from the hospital then, you know, as like normal, like normal ordinary people, they were, uh, was taken to put in a box, put a animal skin box. The box is terrible. Box, I don't know, I mean, the New York, I mean, the LA, Los Angeles. But the, I don't know, it's very strange. The box is animal, animal skin box. The way they, you know, holy put it. It's like Tibet, you know, it's like, it's like, a, and it's like normal, so it's like Tibet. I mean, Tibet, they don't do that. Don't, not, you don't put animal box, animal, animal box, animal skin, you know, like this. <coughs> so anyway, <coughs> then I uh, took the place where they usually, where they fix the body, I think, and body, eyes, and, and, and put, put, the, put eyes in the, the, the place. So then <coughs> I'm brought to uh, Bajapani. Back car to Bajapani on the hill. <coughs> then you see uh, the, uh, the Gomba. There was a few days, you see. So then after the puja finished, before we bring the holy body to offer fire, <coughs> so the <coughs> so and the eyes. So the holy body you see, usually become very hard, you know, like like you know like a wood, you see. Like that tree branches, <coughs> but when, uh, so I think the <coughs> the one Tibetan ex monk from uh, from Bauda group of monastery in the Stupa, <coughs> the Chiron Samdeling, the Kajang Sikhals Mas from Tibet, so the ex monk, and then there was a bill and. A, Two, two, two other, I think, uh, old, old students from Bajapani. <coughs> and John McKay, John McKay and uh, Bill, uh, and uh, maybe John, uh, maybe I was there, I'm not sure. Anyway, <coughs> so they were dealing, uh, trying to take the holy, take the holy body from the, with the eyes in the box. So to make, like, that to, to traditional, you see, the Buddha, the deities' customs, the crowns, everything, you know, there's a way to, you know, making the whole, keeping the, the legs, you know, uh, so, <coughs> um, bell, bajra, and like this, <coughs> then you carry, uh, you carry in the box, so, <coughs> what do you call that one? In the box, Coffee. the house, um, what's that? small house, you know, you carry this, so four people carry it. Huh? What do you call it? Car? Yeah, uh, something, uh, uh, yeah, with the roof. Uh, the roof? No roof. Anyway, <coughs> so Holy Buddha kept up, you know, have a good initiation, with the initiation they did as a uh, material thing. Like that. <coughs> so, uh, brought on from Gomba about that. So they were, <coughs> so the monk, the ex monk, and then to the other. They were trying to fix the body, closing the drawer, they were inside, you know. So then all the limbs, all the, like normal, you know, like normal, and nothing hard. So then, then only when they tried to put together, you know, 
this two four or five, then only the Bodhicitta came out. Only that time. So it means the Lama actually was in meditation state. All those days. <laughs> so because they were putting together, then the Bodhicitta came out, you see. And the monk, ex monk <coughs> Uh, reported to him, so on, but, oh, so he was so shocked. So, oh, this, oh, this. so uh, when he was uh, trying to keep this body in the legs, like this, you know, I think, uh, I think he had, uh, in the, I think probably he had experiences had, had to keep. <coughs> so then that time the body, you know, the white sperm came out. So he said, oh, so he, and then he said, oh, unbelievable smell, he said. That the, he told us the song of the So on that time came out. So he was very surprised. So the reality means Lama was in meditation state all, all the time, even during the puja time, you see. So, but, yeah, so, <laughs> so, we, <coughs> so originally one year to be in meditation, you see. The, I didn't, he didn't order me, but I ordered the other students. <laughs> So I think maybe I'm applying that. And so, <coughs> so they say, <laughs> so I mean, sometimes, <coughs> you know, I think, <coughs> sometimes, according to the Lama's plan, according to that Lama's, I'm not talking Lama, but according to the Lama's, how you want, how you want during the, during the death, <coughs> passing away, you see. Sometimes, you know, depend where you, depend where you pass away, you know, uh, then sometimes that doesn't, doesn't happen exactly. But, uh, uh, that. So, uh, <coughs> so I think many, many they wish to, many, many they want to go back to the east, to the monastery, you see, to pass, to pass away. So then they, they know how to, do, uh, you know, pujas or other dead needs, you see. So, <coughs> don't want to happen in the, uh, in the hospital, you see, uh, here in the West. So, <coughs> yeah. Oh, then, <coughs> mm, then uh, when the fire started, the fire has to be, the fire has to be started by somebody who has no connection of teachings. So I think, <coughs> I think, uh, Probably one girl like them, somebody start the fire, you know. So, it, or, as soon as gave all the, all the advices how to build this, uh, what do you call it, um, where you put the holy body inside, you know, uh, in between, you see, uh, the down below, the oil and all the, uh, all the other uh, things, you see, inside you have to put a mandala, you know. <coughs> so, all the thing. <coughs> so, uh, Gave advice, and then the students there, but apparently built this. And so, <coughs> then when the smoke came out, then he uh, said, "Oh, he said, everybody was happy. He, his face was happy." Aspect. You know, when the smoke came out, uh, uh, <coughs> I, I don't have an idea. Um, I mean, and, and, uh, I said, mm, uh, I didn't have much experience." Uh, of the, you know, uh, say, mm, the, say, <coughs> the, uh, the often fire, you know, the, all the ceremonies, I mean, all the ceremonies, all the things to check what's good, you know, good and bad, all that, you see. <coughs> so, first, when well, the first smoke, I think first smoke's white. So, I don't know. <coughs> so, everybody just saw, and everybody said, uh, show his face, uh, happy face. And then everybody just said, oh, <coughs> oh, oh, he's somebody who uh, reached the plant. He said, oh, somebody who, Lamna Simba, Lamna Simba, he said, it's Lamna Simba, somebody who reached the country plant, you know, who accomplished the country plant, you see. So, so in the, <coughs> in the Lama Chaba, you know, Lamna Masinchi, Lamna Masinchi, if the, if the time, if the death happened, if the death happened, uh, unable to achieve the path, you see. <coughs> Uh, possessed by the path, you know. So that means the path is tangri path, not not three points of path, not renouncing the path, but but it's tangri path. <coughs> so generation completion strategy. 
so I have to that. So then, even I must choose without the time to realization, you see, uh, if, if that happened, then choose to choose the Zendal Sanjal, I may put one And then the forceful, uh, then you need to do a forceful, uh, you know, f- f- I say, urge, urge, I say, yeah. Forcefully, you know, then achieving enlightenment, then the Sangha, forcefully, then achieving enlightenment. <coughs> oh, mm, it means cool way, see. And then the power, uh, the, the cool way to achieve enlightenment, then the power, uh, transferring conscience. And then power, then, don't mind the Jabba Tanghaki, then, Tabishin the Rosin, then, don't mind the Jabba Tanghaki. The advice <coughs> apply well. The uh, mm, the mind apply well with the high power uh, near the death time. You see, apply well. Yeah. And, uh, with that advice, Tabashin to Dovach Nilus. Please grant my blessings to be able to go to pure land. So that, <coughs> uh, so, uh, yeah. So you see. So uh, then you say, said, "Oh, he's somebody who has lamna simba." Means uh, having a, having a slight tantric part, not just bodhicitta, not just bodhicitta right view, you know, emptiness, not just that, but that's all gone. That's already foundation already gone before the the tantric part. You see, mm, sorry. so that, that means that means there's no course, no way, law realm, you know, totally beyond. You see. Mm. So the Buddha was where I remember says his face was a you know, happy face. Uh, oh, the Lamna Simba. Uh, so he told me that. Uh, so the the Seven days uh, kept with a container see, the, the, where you put oil, you see, burn. So put upside down, then. <coughs> uh, <coughs> uh, didn't, uh, didn't, uh, I mean, some lama shows signs, some lama. And I, shows, I don't, rem- don't remember. If sometimes you see feet, you know, small feet, you know, depending on where the feet is facing. And, you know, there's a figure. There's a picture, figure of feet uh, when you took the container when you take it out on the on the ashes. See? <coughs> so, but I don't remember very clearly anything. <coughs> um, maybe there's something, you know, not very clear. I'm not sure. Anyway, <coughs> so that time again, there's a ritual when you do when you do that. So there was a lama's brother, Kishitile, uh, came from Australia. Then there was uh, <coughs> there was one Incan Lama, one Incan Lama whose past life was great Lama uh, in Saracha Monastery, Gengjaze, uh, very famous and um, uh, totally renounced, totally renounced, uh, you know, um, <coughs> renounced, um, extremely learned and a great practitioner, totally renounced. <coughs> Uh, anyway, <coughs> very famous. It's just uh, everybody respect, very high respect. So the his that that great uh, geshe, uh, great mental geshe. He passed away and the medit- uh, reincarnated in Canada. Uh, so there's a one uh, born to Western uh, Western family. <coughs> so he was there. <coughs> so uh, Lama. Enthroned him actually. The Lama in, enthroned him at Vajapani. With the Geshe, with the recent teacher, recent Geshe of Vajapani. Lama enthroned, Lama helped him. So, <coughs> he wasn't enthroned before that. <coughs> so then he was there at that time, the second ceremony, when we went to Puja and they checked, you know, check out the pot and check. <coughs> so then he, uh, I didn't see, but he could see in the sky. Many letters, many letters. Uh, of course, many Tibetan letters in the sky. 
So remember the name of the mother. Well, in the sky, there were some syllables he, he told me. So, I'm not sure. Name of the mother, Maria. There's some, some syllables. Anyway. Okay, that's it. Um, so that's. <laughs> okay, Pulu's uh, Pulu's hunt, Pulu's hunt. Grand um, the Lama could recite this mantra seven times. He won't get the second paralysis, you know, second stroke. Uh, we'll never get. It, you see, uh, so uh, uh, it was uh, it was quite a difficult aspect. You know, the um, you know try to push Lama to recite, uh, but we we try to recite. You know, the Lama. <coughs> so, um, to the, to the, to the, to the, to the uh, after that, so the not easy to uh, the tongue, you see. So, uh, but uh, but uh, but very soon, um, so over the the you know the blessed water, you know the chapters, the purifying uh, lama asked to do that. <coughs> but anyway, mm, <coughs> this is the aspect, you know. <coughs> so. Uh, so anyway, it recovered very, uh, very soon. <coughs> um, <coughs> of course, it is in the Lama's hand, you know, not like ordinary people. So, <coughs> yeah. Mm. Mm. So that, so, so even though I have seen the mantra in the text, but this is what but specifically what his song uh, advises that. Mm. So. Mm. So then, uh, what do you do is if somebody got a somebody got a stroke, first stroke, you see, or some paralysis, then uh, <clears throat> uh, if you have a chance to help, then you give this mantra to the person to recite, mm, or uh, with some other per- with the outside person to get together can recite you see, a mantra seven times. So that then this way the person doesn't get a st- second stroke, then much uh, easier, more opportunity to recover. You see. <coughs> Uh, usually, seems that in the hospital, seems that extremely d- d- rare, difficult to recover because there's no much, there's no much medicine, as well as the massage, only massage. But the, so somebody who has a very light karma, who don't have karma to get sick all that, you know, like then by doing very few, they, they're by doing some massage, then get better. It happened, uh, but but no much, so, but no much hope. Mm. <coughs> uh, Francisco, 